We have SpongeBob SquarePants and Patrick Starr going up against the Master Chief and also Spartan War. Three, two, one. Oh, ho, ho, ho. what up, Rat Pack? It's your boy here, King Reptar, back with another video. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. And if you guys are, you know the drill. Let me do the whole camera. Beyblade, let it rip. <laughs> it's about to get a whole lot brighter, Rat Pack, because your boy is here. Yeah? And today, we are going to be having, as you guys do, the Beyblade flip. It is going to be a Beyblade video. You guys have been asking for this for so long so make sure you guys smash that like button subscribe if you're new here but today what we're going to be doing is we're going to be working with two knockoff brands only two this time but one of them is literally legendary so we're going to be messing with epic beyblades as you know parker but what if i told you there is another brand that makes some spinning tops but they're branded and i'm not like, talking branded with like you know cow branding yeah <laughs> like batman like superman like um, like brands like mainstream things all right I'm, i guess i'm ready to see that can you imagine you saw a beyblade that was like freaking Timmy Turner. Very, I'll be specific. Yeah, uh, that would be cool. That'd it be wouldn't great. be cool. You'd be wishing for it. Cosmo Wanda, hit me up. But we're going to be messing with some Beyblades that actually had the money to work with brands and they're themed around other products. But first, we're going to show the first Beyblade knockoff here, and that is Mega Gyro. <laughs> That's like Ty, but if he was like any white kid in third grade. Dude, check out the other side. There's a robot. <laughs> That's like a robot that launches the Beyblade. But here we go. Let's pop these open. And we're going to be putting them up against Beyblades in the ghetto. Damn. <laughs> we could use that official stadium over there, but it got warped in my car from heat. Maybe you should take things out of your car. Yeah, that's what my dog said. <laughs> No, I'm kidding. My dog never stays in the car. You shouldn't do that either. And if you do, make sure all the windows are down and it's for less than five minutes. All right, peace is over. <laughs> Why is it the ghetto? Because it's, it's I don't oh, really know. It's God, just dirty. What kind of dirt is that? I think that this was used in... Bucket to clean up dog what is it? What, what I is this stuff? I don't know what the... I think this might have been like a most dangerous Beyblade stadium from a long time ago. I don't really know. But the point is, it's okay. the ghetto. Let's go get the Beyblades and poof them up against these. But first off, let's open them up. And then guys, we're going to be doing the next one, which is like brand that like I am really excited to show you guys as well because it's an American one, and like I said, it's got branding. But let's check out not branding. This is actually kind of cool, though. I'm not gonna lie. I do like this ripstick. The ripstick itself, I will give some credit for originality because it's like my boy Rocket from Rock'em Sock'em. <laughs> Let's give him a name. What we should call him? I'm gonna call him Pessimist Prime. <laughs> Pessimist Prime. <laughs> Fumblebee. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys leave your comment. Your transformer name for this guy in the comments down below. Make sure it's stupid. <laughs> this thing has like a. Damn! I thought he had a snake in his boot for a second. <laughs> <laughs> this thing has a pull string just like an old school Woody from Toy Story. Let's go ahead and lock on a Beyblade. We got the stadium right here. Oh, wow. Nothing to this Beyblade, but the good thing is, you got this one. <laughs> All right, let's do the first rip on this thing, though. I'm not gonna lie, it looks like mine was used already. This looks like the wrapper that came in something else. All right, let's lock this thing on there. Dude, I will give it credit for that. Check this out. Get real close. <laughs> oh, oh. Yeah, I mean, that's pretty cool. It's magnetic. Three, two, one. Oh, you yeah. missed. But... And I also just broke the string. <laughs> Let me get one of those. <laughs> it still works. All right, three, two. This is hurting my fingers. One. <laughs> didn't go off. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> did lighting up? Hey, I'll give it credit for that. I didn't even know they lit up. Hey, I didn't do this by Skechers. <laughs> <laughs> three, two, one. There we go. Now we got a solid spin, and now I decide it's not gonna light up. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna go straight into a battle versus this one real quick to see, just to warm things up, and then we're gonna be moving on to the competitor. Three, two, one. Come on, Humblebee. Yeah. All right, he's in there. He's lighting up. Now let's see what does a power of Beyblade have to offer. What do you think, dude? <laughs> it's, it's looking The Beyblade's doing a lot of work, for sure. But it doesn't seem like it's slowing it down. Dude, it's slowing it down significantly. Oh, oh my oh, god! Oh, right here! Oh, wait, and now he's calling in his robot. Boom! Oh! Right there! Now that's a finishing move. <laughs> Now we have to put it against the ultimate competitor. This is what I think is the top tier of knockoff Beyblade. He may not look like it, but he is. <laughs> now I am gonna get what is probably the most notable Beyblade ripoff to ever come out. And I'd say probably the only one to give it a run for its money. We got, let me just bring it in. Versus Rip Spin Warrior, right here. So these guys right here, you spin them around and they start attacking, right? Really? Yeah, their arms, like, so he has guns, you see them? They swing and they try to knock the head up on these ones. So they're like Rock'em Sock'em's mixed with Beyblades. That's like awesome mixed with awesome. Exactly, but it won't be more awesome. I got a rip spin, a special 
especially for me, and I got one especially for you. What? Because I told you, they have brandy. So, here's some of the ones we got right here. Right here, these are for nobody. I mean, you could pick them if you would like, but right here, we got Batman and Harley Quinn. What? <laughs> they had this, this is before, Bay, like, Beyblade kind of took these, these guys out, but they have actual branding, and that is Harley Quinn and Batman. And then next up, we got Iron Man and Iron Man. Iron Man and Captain America? Or, I guess you can say it either way. I mean, one of the two. <laughs> <laughs> but for you, yeah. I got this one. Oh! <laughs> oh, that's Sick. Yes, Master Chief and also the Spartan from Halo. Can that? Oh my God! Can you that believe so they made sick. Halo ones? No, I can't believe they made any of these. But you won't believe this last one There's for one. me. Oh! <laughs> Oh my god. Unbelievable, right? That's disturbing, but that's so sick. <laughs> these were fifty dollars. Well these like ones. like all of them. No, just this one. No. <laughs> this was more expensive than everything here. Like, fifty you're, just, you're, not, you're not using those, right? Yeah, I'm gonna use them. Oh my god. <laughs> so it's gonna take us a little time. We have to set up this stadium, which you've never set up before. But then we're gonna get straight into it. We will see what we'll win. Master Chief or Master Fry Cook. Hey, hey, you gotta drop your phone, man. We gotta make it look like we did it ourselves. What? We gotta make it look like we did it ourselves. You're done? Turn off. It's done! Oh my god, I know why they went out of business. <laughs> <laughs> I never had so much trouble with a stapled one piece of paper for the instruction book. I'm tired. This was a drag. She could borrow said it best. This was a pain in the rear. This was so difficult, Rep Pack. We were just like spit dead ass like 35 minutes trying to figure out how to get these things to go down the ramp. You know how we figured it out? You just press the button faster. You know, okay, so I, want, I just want to clarify. It, building it was not the difficult part. Yeah, that was too bad. Actually making it work. Was. Yes, getting these to work correctly was a difficult challenge, but nonetheless, they are done. So, we're gonna be having a one on one battle. On top, what these guys do, let me show you what they do first off. Hopefully, hopefully, I can show you. It is a mess up. Let's try it out. Go ahead and pick your character. You already know which one your boy picked. I'm going with SpongeBob SquarePants. And I'm uh, going with Patrick. No, no, no. I got both of these. <laughs> <laughs> Only reason why is because there's also a dual battle as well. And it wouldn't make sense if I had like SpongeBob and like Harley Quinn. Stupid. Sounds like a Something, you know, people would fantasize about. Sounds like Harley Quinn have a lot more fun than Spongebob. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Anyway, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna... Well, we kinda just... Okay, but well, good, because I paid like 30 bucks for that, so I'm glad. <laughs> <laughs> Let me pop up in mine, and then we're gonna pop up Parker's as well and check them out. So, right here, guys, these are epic, and I hope they don't get scratched up too much, because I'd love to put these on the shelf. You're, you're gonna battle with them, so... I know, but... It's like they're fun. I'm battling you, so... Maybe I won't get scratched up. Oh, maybe, maybe, you're gonna, maybe you're gonna get destroyed. <laughs> maybe you're not gonna have anything to go home with. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so on SpongeBob, he got his classic spatula. We got the spatula. Let's go ahead and put that on his arms right there. Classic. We go with that right there. And then he also, SpongeBob, gets two things. And then we got his fishing net right there. And this is like, I think it only works with SpongeBob because SpongeBob is known for changing his form and his shape. But with Patrick, here you come, Pivot. <laughs> and Patrick comes with the firmly grasped bit bubble blower. And then also just his regular arm. Old reliable. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all reliable. That's all 14 year olds like to call it. Yeah, I'm not the only one that knows that SpongeBob got two things and he got one thing. Hey, I mean, come on, this Patrick. <laughs> so those are my two right there. Let's check out the Halo ones too, real quick. All right, we got Master Chief. Oh, uh, Chief, 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 sorry. <laughs> You're gonna have to give me the, the accuracy of these ones. I am not the biggest Halo fan, I guess, honestly. I'm not the biggest Halo fan, nor am I that knowledgeable about it. So, are they pretty accurate? He looks accurate. I mean, yeah, he's got the energy sword. He's got his freaking assault rifle. Damn, I didn't even realize he had the energy sword. That is sick. We got his energy sword. All right, so there you go. We got Master Chief. The energy sword is his arm. <laughs> That's the Magnum, the pistol, and then that should be the SMG, I want to say. The Uzi. <laughs> Imagine you're playing <laughs> the, Halo. The vert. <laughs> <laughs> you're like in Halo, like you're, I'm in this other world, you got this Master Chief helmet. He's like, here's your weapon, an Uzi. <laughs> It's a good thing they don't have Uzis and Mac Tins in Halo. But now we are gonna have a warrior. Pick one of your two. Who are you gonna pick as your one man? Master J. Okay, Master Chef. And then right over here we got okay. SpongeBob and Patrick. Master Chef again over here. Master All right. Chief versus Master Chef. Yes. Now we're gonna put them up on here, and we are gonna hope to God that they work correctly. <laughs> All right. So how we're gonna do this, guys? Just so you guys understand everything. I'm gonna pull. We're gonna pull at the same time, and thankfully this thing has a like a basically a fair release button. We're gonna release them both at the exact same time. That's where we had a lot of our problems at. But if it works correctly, it gives them a perfect equal chance of hitting the stadium at the exact same time. So let's try it out. Three, two, one. Come on, let's go. Oh, oh, oh. who's gonna win it? Come on, oh my God. yeah, he is the victor. He's not the 
Victor, we both went out the same time. Yeah, but there was an actual battle that time, and when I went out, I was still spinning, and nothing kept me on the table but bouncing. All right, here we go. So again, I, I got the first W that is on the record, that is but right. you, we're gonna have one more competition. No, no more bars. If it goes out, if it whoever's on the table last is the victor. All right, let's see it. Three, two, one. Okay, they are hitting the track. Your face is gone, but you're down. I don't know, like, I, I mean, you're not even competing. I'm still spinning. I mean, I guess we just wait this out. <laughs> what do you mean? You have no traction. You, of course you're gonna be still spinning at the end. I win! Oh my god, I won! <laughs> no, that's not how this works. Three, two, one. They are both in there. Who is gonna take the cake? Who is gonna get the vi- Oh! And look at that victory No! Oh, look at that victory lap. This ain't no victory lap. The only victory lap is the getting is in the toilet, going around, around, around. <laughs> All right, so you guys saw quite a few battles using the downstairs attack. You guys let me know who won those competitions. It's kind of a little bit here and there between all three of those matches. But now what we're gonna be doing is a two on two battle. We're gonna be putting both characters in these side loaders right here. You can launch two characters at once and battle them. But for me, I have always wanted to do this. I mean, freaking. You know, some people might ask this question like, oh, survival situation, you take any fictional character with you to survive in a zombie apocalypse. Some people would pick, like, well, it's a good pick. Iron Man. Superman. Superman. That's Superman's that's great. <laughs> Rip them open. What are you talking about? Left for Dead crew. Goku, I guess. <laughs> yeah, no, it's probably better. Actually. I would pick SpongeBob and Patrick. At least they can keep me company. <laughs> and they're funny. <laughs> so, I got my boys right here about to go into battle. Here we go. And now, who are you going to pick against the gang gang? The, the gang gang with actual gun guns. Halo, Halo. <laughs> We got the spatula and the bubble blower ready. Let's do it. All right, guys. So here we go. Right now, play the intense music. We have SpongeBob SquarePants and Patrick Starr going up against, you know him. You love him. The Master Chief and also Spartan War. You probably never thought you were gonna see this on Death Battle. I <laughs> mean, why? You probably aren't. But you're gonna see here right now. Who will win, SpongeBob or Master Chief? Let me know in the comments down below who you think would win in a fight to the death. Three, two, one, rip them. Okay. Three, two, one. Oh! Oh! oh, oh. oh. No! Oh, yeah! No. Damn, oh, yeah. The Halo team. Oh, God damn. Killed his own teammate. He needs something to kill constantly. He goes <laughs> <laughs> even a minute without murder. It's like not having a breath. <laughs> so, let's try it one more time. And then we're going to compete the Beyblades versus the Z Rippers just to see what happens. Three, two, one. All right. Three, two, one. Okay. Oh. Come on. Why did he always oh, fall? Oh, yes, dude. dude. Okay. Woo! What the hell, dude? They have guns, like. But Patrick and freaking SpongeBob exclusively tip over. They do just exclusively. Oh, well, they see what's happening, they just like run. <laughs> <laughs> All right, rep back. So it seems like SpongeBob and Patrick weren't really the strongest of the V Rip Spin Warriors, but I'm enjoying these figures quite a lot. Just the way they design them, it's awesome. For the outro, let's go ahead and put Beyblade up against the Rip Spin. It. All right, so we got Valtex in there. Here we go. Three, two, one. All right, he's in there. Oh, he's going straight for him. All right, three. Two, one, hit them. <laughs> oh my god. Come on. They're lasting. They're lasting, but. Oh, 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 oh. Damn, dude. Halo Master Chief just went off the rails. All right, so it looks like Rip Spin Warriors won, but I think it's just because of their physicality. But if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you guys smash that like button, subscribe if you guys are new here, and check out this video on your screen right here, which is the last episode of Beyblades versus Knockoffs. It was a lot of fun. Go check it out. I'll see you guys over there. As always, Rep Pack, I will see you beautiful people in the next one. Adios. Bloop.